Welcome back today, I've got a huge surprise for you guys. We're gonna see a national treasure, Lester. But first, we're stopping for a sushi at Kuru Kuru Sushi. No way we're at a sushi restaurant. I'm trusting about the sushi restaurant. Let's look at the wasabi. Holy shit! Yo, you got that. I didn't know, but it's so good. Why is he like a contact? Also, like, is there much hard protection? Well, there are, but... I don't think I can damage your well-being any more than it already is. You were trying it? Oh, protection! Barely legal. In the words of the honor. Then, we were on our way to the national treasure. It's so nice. Every night's a good night to get kidnapped. You know what? If I get kidnapped, they picked me. Why if they didn't pick you and you were the only one they could find? I don't know how to explain it, but I just feel like it'd be good for me because like... Good for your ego, good for your self-esteem. I have someone to talk to. True. Did you not talk to anyone that long? <laughs> Look at the skin of your lungs. Sorry? Heal down. We're here at the McDonald's. The new McFlurry Galaxy with Maltesers and George's Apple Pie. Alright, great, great, great. We've got a McDonald's and we're going. To see a very interesting thing. It's just a vat of some sort. Put in the comments down below what you think of <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that. We're going to find the vat. You had your chance to thumb them and it's all over. Actually, you kind of mad. I smell the vat. It's it's not good, good, yummy. Can you tell us the story behind this vat? Okay, so basically, basically. there's this guy called Emad. Um, Emad. Someone asked oh, for Adju GP. State his full okay. name, address. Um, I don't know what his surname is. He's from Nottingham. He's actually from Egypt. He's from a family of doctors. He really likes cats. You're really leaking all his info here. 10 out of 10 would recommend to a friend. Mm. Um, and he took me to this place. And he kept saying to me, like, oh, I need to take this pot of biryani. Like, just keep adding it. But he was doing this with his hands. Like, this is like this big, right? Like, yeah. this, like, this big, yeah. right? Like, he's like, this pot of biryani that like, James his hands. He's like, okay. And he just led me there. And he took me to this place. And he told me, wait, I think you have to see the biryani pot to hear the full story. Okay, so we're now going to go find the biryani pot. But Jaya, with her small fish brain, has forgotten where it was. <laughs> so George is going to lead us to it. Our, our Greek it's savior. Actually, it's actually propaganda. Like, it's propaganda actually, against who? I guess me in favor of George. <laughs> as you, as classic, it should be. Classic, classic Xavier. Anything to put me down because it also puts George up. This is not where I took him. You did not it's take there. him. It's there. Guys, 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 it's right there. It's I, right think there. Sh I think you should skip up to it. <laughs> oh my god, let's go, guys. <laughs> let's go, guys. <laughs> Do this jam run on a summer ball. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Okay, we have arrived. Oh shit. So, guys, welcome to the. Lester pot of biryani. Every night, someone no, no, goes on top of there and stirs the biryani. No, 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 no,